welcome to Court Farm Chickens and today we're going to be talking about the Khaki Campbell. Okay, so here we have the very popular Khaki Campbell duck. Uh, it's got a grass and a beak. So this is a female. You can tell that by the fact that they quack. Only female ducks quack. Uh, look at our other videos on how to tell the difference between the man and female. But we will cover that here as well. So all Khaki Campbells are the same colour. That's one downside to them. The, the good thing about them is they're a very, very good starter duck. They're quite friendly. They're relatively easy to tame. There's no duck that will ever be as tame as a pet chicken. Um, ducks are not just aquatic chickens. They are a very different animal and require a lot of different care and patience. So these are more of a traditional duck sort of shape. So she's just uh, calling to her mates. But they're uh, quite low down, squat to the floor, traditional duck shape but they are all this brown color. It does sometimes vary. You can see on the wing here, you've got a bit of a lighter brown. Sometimes the entire duck will be that lighter brown, but they will all be this shade or, or variation of, that's why they're called the khaki Campbell. You can get a white Campbell, which is the exact same duck, but it's white, but it is classed as a different uh, breed. So she is, so they have the black bill uh, that can vary in shade a little bit. Uh, the orange feet and a, a small flat tail. Uh, these are really good garden ducks. They can't fly. Uh, they get quite big, quite heavy. Um, very good for egg production. These are basically the duck version of a standard brown ISA hen. So they provide a lot of um, good duck eggs. And they will live very happily with any other breed of duck. They will also breed with other breeds of duck. Um, and, and produce viable eggs but again like with all the other sort of breeds of chicken when you're crossbreeding is never a guarantee exactly what those will look like so that's the female uh, you've heard the quack there uh, i will just quickly go over it but there is another video so you've got the quack is a female and on the back is a flat tail so we'll put her down and then we'll try and get the male and uh show you her him Nice boy. Okay, so here we have the male. Now we are just getting into the beginning of the duck breeding season, so he's got all his colorations coming through. Now, this is one of the differences between the males and females is the males actually change color depending on the time of year. So you can see here, he's now got a lovely green head, like a mallard. But uh, as a young duck and going through a molt, that will go back to this brown. So it's, it makes it harder to tell the males and females. At the moment, it's very obvious because he's got a bright green head. The feet are a lot darker color as well than the females. So if the head is the same color, the way you tell is the fact that males don't quack. Uh, they do bite, but they don't quack. Um, he might make his little male noise. It's more of a rasping noise, um, but you'll hear that on the other videos. Um, but the other easy way, on the back, on the tail, it's not flat like the female. You've got what's called the, the, the drake feather or the sex feather, and it, it curls up. Um, it's quite flat on him, actually. They normally sort of curl right, right the way around like that. But nevertheless, there is a curl there, so you can tell. So exactly the same as the female, really. They require no extra care. The only thing is when mixing males and females, they can get aggressive towards each other uh, at mating times. So we like to do a minimum ratio of one male duck to three females. Um, even if you've done it 10 female ducks to one male, um, they would still fight because uh, they're like that. But they're less likely to cause any real harm or, or fight for prolonged periods if there are lots of females to go around. Never leave one female duck with two males. They're quite aggressive when they mate. Uh, they like to mate on water. And if two males go for the same female, they are likely to drown her. That's the ugly side of ducks. Apart from that, uh, same with the female. Uh, exactly the same size, shape. Um, very easy to care for, the Carty Campbells. 
But, um, yeah, very good backyard duck. So thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one.